After getting their perspective on sourcing, we asked about interviewing and the trends and challenges and tactics that they're seeing. I think the number one tactic is making the process extremely personal. With the rise of remote work, it's easy for candidates to take the afternoon off, interview your company, a morning off, interview at some other company, and then do the same thing tomorrow and the next day, or just do it once a week, because why not keep yourself open to opportunity? And because it's easier to interview, candidates are taking a lot more conversations with way more companies than they ever have before. Uh, that can hurt you, but it can also help you in a lot of ways. I think first, being personal helps you convert one of those tire kicking interviews into a real process and converting somebody to actually a hire. And I think the second way it helps you is the more personal you are, the more candidates going to share with you. They'll tell you about what they're looking for, how active they are in the interview process, like what actually matters to them. And it allows you to understand like the bucket of things a candidate wants versus what your company has to offer and if that's bridgeable or not. One thing that I feel that we've done at LinkedIn because we're, we're evolving our, our platform as we're going through this, right? So some of the things that I'm excited about that we've built is now you're you're doing things where you have a cover story. We just recently launched that on LinkedIn. If you've seen it, where now when you hover over your profile, you can have a video representation of yourself. And that is a real quick way for people to kind of get to know you uh, a little bit better rather than this static profile that you have on your profile. So I think that is one thing that we added that I that we're seeing is, is being utilized and it just brings it to life. Whereas before you maybe had to get on that phone call, you had to meet them in person and, and be able to get a feel of who they are. So I think that's one uh, representation of how we're evolving the product. You might have noticed on some of the LinkedIn profiles we'll have open to work or hiring. It's like put yourself out there in a more direct way on the platform so that people know that I am looking for a job. I am open to work. Find me, reach out to me in any way. And so you think about all the tools of how you can reach out to someone, right? You have uh, LinkedIn messaging uh, is, is a way and just connecting and, and how encouraging people to apply to, to jobs on the platform. So I, there's just so many ways that I see it differently uh, happening in this world. Hiring is about the long game, especially hiring leaders. As I think about the best leaders I've hired over time and and the roles I've taken in my career, almost all of them I can point to the first conversation we had at least a year prior to you know when we started the formal interview process. And I see that across the board. Now, what's special about where we are right now and what, what we can do to take advantage is like you just talked about these 15 minute meetings, this kind of quick check in, it's a lot easier to have these touch points with folks, you know, across the year. And so maybe these 15 minute meetings aren't the let's have the full interview conversation, but it's an easy way to stay in touch. And like I said, play the long game and keep folks warm so that when they are in that moment ready to make a jump, um, you're their top of mind.